Welcome back. This is the Cell Guru Show. I promised you two top stories, and this is a big one, literally the big boy from Nokia. Nokia introduced its X-Men army to the world at the Mobile World Congress this year. And now the biggest of this series, the Nokia XL, has finally launched in India at about 11,000 rupees. Now, while the XL offers a very large screen, it is, of course, runs on Android and Android apps, and it has Nokia hardware, the game being played here is at a whole different level. This is a business strategy at a completely different level. This is Nokia playing the rebel playing up and against and with the Android army. And also this is Nokia's attempt to break from the shackles of the only Windows domain. Tough things to do all at once. And we'll start off our review with the design. The handset itself follows Nokia's current design ethos of minimalistic style and very, very bright colors. The Nokia XL is on the thicker side and feels heavy, but very solid in the hand. But remember, it weighs 190 grams. The display at 800 by 480p is a 5-inch display on this Nokia XL phone, but it isn't going to win any awards for clarity. It's a decent viewing experience, just not awesome. The colors of the tires look bright, the track is smooth, very smooth. Now the main attraction of the Nokia XL is of course in its operating system which is built on the Android open source platform. There is no Google Play to access Android apps but there are third party app stores to make sure you get the app you wish for. In fact, the big myth is about the fact that you can only get the apps from the store that's made for this. I'm going to just demonstrate to you how you can actually get apps from third parties onto the phone. Go to Nokia store, search for the desired app. You'll find most of the good ones there anyway. For the rest, a list of third-party stores pop up. Choose the store. Search your app on the third-party store. Download your app. The user interface is overly simple too. The two main screens, the app list screen and fast lane. The app screen reminds us of the Lumia in its look and feel as this too has a very tiled interface but it doesn't have the same finesse, not yet. Also this phone combines fast lane of the Asha series. The fast lane runs feeds of the latest activity on the Nokia XL, thanks to which we can even multitask on the phone. Nokia has also included a bunch of its Lumia apps from the XL including its store, camera, mix radio, and here, maps. Another myth that perpetuates about the Nokia X series is that it cannot multitask one app and that's all you have. Well, actually, it can and very easily. Here's how. Open the first app. For instance, we've opened up the browser to access NDTV.com. Open the second app. For instance, Facebook. Long press on the back button, reach the menu. Swipe to fast lane. You can select the open app where you left it and continue from there. There's a 5 megapixel camera with an LED flash. Nokia has also loaded up the camera app with a buffet of features including color effects, play detection and control for brightness, white balance, contrast and saturation. There is a 2 megapixel front camera too. Now the Nokia XL comes with a 1 gigahertz new core processor, 768 MB of RAM and 4 GB of internal storage. One can peel off the color seating of the Nokia XL to gain access to the dual SIM slot and the micro SD port plus the removable 2000 mAh battery. Time now for the Cell Guru verdict on the big one from Nokia. The XL is a true value for money phone in every which way and it is the best amongst the X-Men series. Now it does lack that true Android feel and charm, which is why if you're thinking that's what you'll get, do try it once at the shop before you buy it. It gives you the best of both worlds, Android and Windows on one large screen. So what's the final thing I have to say? Well, I would say Nokia, pursue this, don't give up on the X series. We're really looking forward to what you can do the next time. And speaking of the next, let's move on next to Techometer where we have two brand new phones and a tough verdict. <laughs>